All right, so I'm over here just outside of view, and I'll try to keep this down here out of view. <laughs> sort of, kind of. So this one I got um, from Mr. Lance Mountain. He gave it to me um, in about 85, maybe, I think, 85 or 86. Um, maybe 86. No, I think 85. 85, because I was still riding his boards, and so I'm at his house at the Mountain Manor skating, and uh, we're hanging out in the garage, and we're just talking about boards. Oh, let me have a have a, a sip, because I'm, I'm parched here. So I raise my push bug to all of you. Aloha. Hope you guys are doing well. And yes, I bought this from Jay Graham Britton from his website. So, yeah, that's right. Not looking for the freebie. I'll take my glasses because I'm reflecting from the lights over there. So, anyway, so I'm at Lance's house, and I've been riding his boards. So we're hanging out, and we're just looking at stuff, and uh, there's a board that he has in the garage that I was like, ooh, that's cool. And... Um, we got to talking about how many of them he had and 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 uh, and whatnot, and uh, and he's looking at th in this thing and, and he's like, "Well, you can have this one," um, and I was like, "Really?" He's like, "Yeah, you can have it." I go, "Okay," and I actually wrote it for a while too, and you can see it's it's kind of destroyed because I wrote it for as long as I possibly could. Whether I don't know whether I needed a board or not, but Lance was kind enough to give this one to me, and it is a very special one. It's one of his shapes, but has the the infamous uh, C. R. Stesic the third artwork on it with the mask face that I don't really know the story behind this one but this one is in his shape the Lance Lance's shape um, doesn't really have anything else it has a witch sticker on the top which I don't know if I put that there or not because I don't see why Lance would have a witch sticker but anyway so Lance wrote this one. Um, for a while, but most people know the graphic from, of course, the the uh, Bones Brigade video show where he's skating around on the street, and um, so he has a small a street board that has orange. It's orange with the the skull on it, and I don't know whether it's because um, you it's harder it's harder to see the mask on the black that it maybe didn't get used, uh, but he wrote it, and then he he was gracious enough, gracious enough to. Uh, hand it to me. And oh, I see the remnants of another Witch Carlsbad pipeline sticker there, so um, he must have put them on there too. We all did. Everybody loves Witch Carlsbad pipelines in, in Carlsbad because they are such great people. So, yes. Um, oh, I get a thumbs up from Lance. Yes. Yeah, Tony, Tony Hallam, that is a crazy one, isn't it? Yeah, but it's super cool um, that I don't really know. If it's just stenciled, maybe? It is, the, the paint is kind of raised, so he must have just stenciled that on there. But it's super cool um, and quite rare, <laughs> I would imagine. But um, thank you, Lance. And I did, I have pictures of me riding it somewhere. Um, but I wrote it for a, a long time and I was really kind of like, oh, it's, it is hand stenciled, according to Lance Mountain. Yes, hand stenciled. Yes, uh, awesome. So I, I rode this for a while and, you know, until the nose was falling off. And, uh, you know, Lance, one of my, you are seriously, uh, no, no, no joke, you are definitely one of the uh, most important people for me in life, not just in skateboarding, but in life, and um, has just setting such a positive uh, example for someone like me, the amateur coming up in the ranks, wanting to be so much like them. And I just emulated um, Lance and Stevie and and those guys to a fault, probably. And uh, yes, because I even got shot down by one of my heroes for being too much like that. Too Xerox copy E. <laughs> so, but hey, you know, that's, that's also a, an important learning uh, thing too, to because uh, you do even though you want to emulate your heroes and you, um, you you want to be like them, you still have to take what they offer you and take it somewhere else. 
And so uh, having that sort of hard, hard lesson from one of your heroes is, uh, is very important. And um, I wouldn't change a thing because it definitely kind of was a big wake up call. It's like, oh wait, wait, now I'm, it's, I'm, now I'm annoying. And I don't wanna be annoying to my heroes. So, you know, that's, <laughs> that's a good thing. So anyway, I have to do the little pause with, with the board as my, yeah, as my, my thumbnail for the YouTube video that I will put up when I get to it. So I'll, I'll take my glasses off so I don't have the, the reflection of my light. But this is, this is one of the coolest things I have. And it will go in the garage and mounted at some point when I have it up there. And again, thank you, Lance, for all the years of inspiration, for giving me that board, and just kind of um, just being there for me. And, uh, you, you know, I don't know if you remember, um, but you wrote me a letter, handwritten letter, thanking me uh, in 85 for writing your model and uh, saying how that when you were, you were on uh, Veriflex and they, the, they told you they were, they were thrilled that you were writing their boards at that time. Um, so... You said that it's important, and you reached out and let me know that you appreciated it, and I, of course, appreciated that. And unfortunately, that was in a box that um, has gone by the wayside, which I think was in a, a, my parents. Uh, so they had a uh, storage unit that got broken into, and then a bunch of my stuff went probably to the swap meet <laughs> in Oceanside. But anyway, uh, yes, so before I get too much more rambly, Cheers to you, Lance. Cheers to uh, the years of friendship and inspiration.